Hello, hello. Welcome on into another episode of the Whiskey Crusaders. I'm Will. I'm Sarah. No, I'm Matt. And Weasley. This is Weasley. He's a very Today we're talking excited. once again about another barrel product. Yeah. This is mm-hmm. their bourbon, batch number 34. Mm-hmm. Be sure to hit that like and subscribe button and click that notification bell. Matt, tell us a little bit about this. All right. Barrel, batch 34. Beautiful six years, cash strength, non show filter. This was sent to us by uh, Barrel, so we want to appreciate that. Of course, with yes. no strings attached. As usual, we've done lots of fun Barrel products because we really enjoy their products, and they usually send us really fun, good stuff. It is 57.31%, so it's a very specific. It's made up of 6, 8, 10, 15-year-old barrels, starting with a base of high corn barrels for a few months, then added the high rye barrels to it, then a vatting of 10 and 15-year-olds were added together to finish up the blend. It's a blend of straight bourbon distilled in Tennessee, Kentucky, and Indiana, all aged white American oak and bottled in Kentucky. All right, I'm going to see the uh, history of Barrel, and then we've also had them on some streams. We'll go back and check those out. Ooh. All right, let's see what we think of this new Barrel 34 they sent us. Oh, thank goodness. So much caramel. It is a lot of caramel. We just came off of a very Ooh. cherry heavy bourbon, and this is not, not it. it. And it's tons of allspice, too. Yeah. And cinnamon. Cinnamon. Yeah, peanut brittle, cloves, cloves. cinnamon. Yes. Leather, a little bit of cherry, honey, vanilla. Orange with clove sticking in it that you boil. Yeah. Oak spice, caramel, butterscotch, toffee, black pepper, sea salt, a little bit of celery. Yeah. It smells really good. It does smell smell really good. Yeah. I'm really glad it doesn't have that one distinct smell to it on the nose you and me but both typical. i was afraid i know when i first opened this it had a little more of that but that seems to have completely dissipated so we did a um live stream with this one uh maybe a couple months ago at this point but yeah that's all dissipated, it's, which i greatly appreciate it's it's really hit or miss for me on some of the barrel products because that is a prominent note and that's a term right. thing, unfortunately um so it is really hit or miss for barrel but, but this, this nose one, smells excellent the it, nose smells great. It does have a protein powder in the background of it. But it's not that. It's not that. Yeah, it's like orange protein powder, too. It's it's an interesting note. It's like the... I take um, I take chewable vitamin C. Mm. Yeah, I could see it. Like an ester C or something. Yeah. And interesting. PBS brand. <laughs> Mm. Oh, that allspice is just as prevalent on the palate. Yeah, Holy it's crap. It that caramel and the clove. Wow. Very, very clovey. Yeah. It's got You're not kidding. On. That's like a clove cigarette in your mouth. Damn. Boiled peanut, cinnamon leather. Fortunately, oh. have a little bit of that Tennessee. Vanilla, cherry. In there on coffee. the back. Black and again, pepper. to me, it's presenting itself as a protein powder more so yeah. as, a, a, as that Flintstone vitamin I get when it's just the straight Tennessee. Yeah. That being said, it does it does have that bit of that powdery whey protein. Yeah. Vanilla. Yeah. A little bit of that vanilla, yeah. yeah. The protein yeah, powder. Yeah, but it's not, a, it's not full-on Flintstone vitamin. No, so no. It's, a, yeah, it's that vanilla, yeah. Whatever they're mixing it with. It's not a lot of it, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I like it though. It's good. I, I enjoy that. Yeah, it's it's, nice. it's not it's not bad at all for um having that. Yeah, I know um, last year batch thirty three was our bourbon of the year, so this is good, but I, I think know. based on what we've also tasted this year, we've done I was just about to say, like based on some of the things that we've had this year. We've done some crazy bourbon. stuff this year, so you know. I don't think this one's gonna win bourbon of the year. But we're still, but it's still very May. good. Yeah, I still really like it though. We're still only in May. This is tasty. Mm-hmm. Um, it's a it's a well put together blend. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I mean, I mean, you can get the, the... Use ninety on this one, so it was just typical for barrel. Yeah, yeah. but they're all that price. It's not that a. Way. That's just barrel's price. Right. So, <laughs> I just that is what they cost. If you'll notice, I don't have any in my cabinet. Um. We do still have some. I have lots of them. Got tail up there. <laughs> I have many barrel products. Yeah, when those were ninety. Yeah. Granted, a lot of them were also sent to me by barrel anymore. That's fair. Okay. 
Yeah. But I do, we do have uh, several other barrel products to review for you guys. I sent us that package too that's got four in it. We got a couple other single barrel. I still have lots of barrels for us to review. We still need to review Dovetail because Dovetail is wow. amazing. We have well, and there's several of those out now too. So many freaking barrel products. I bet you we probably have between, I bet you I have like 20 plus barrel products we still have to review. Probably I have, have, more I have tons of them. in your house than anything else. Yeah, I have mm -hmm. lots of barrel products. Yeah. You know, and then I have the ones they send to us too. So it's like we just have a lot. Right. So I know the right. Vantage was really fun. We'll just probably do that one soon for you guys. I really like that one too. Mm. So yeah, this is good. I like it. I mean, you know, it's just very solid bourbon. I mean, I got really no complaints about it. Uh, but I enjoy it though. I think it's a good job. Yep. Good job, Barrel. We really tell the pull the rye out of there too. So yeah, yeah. no. It's a good job. I think I think it's a bit overpriced, but I'm a pretty harsh critic when it comes to these things. So well, when you work work at a liquor store and you see these things all the time and you know, yeah. I, I can understand that. Well, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button and click that notification bell. Come hang out with us live on Monday nights and check out the Patreon for more fun. And until next time. Keep on crusading for better whiskey in your glass. Cheers. Cheers. Please leave. All right. Now it's just time for the course. Will's favorite.